morning allure. It is around 10.20 a.m. and it's time to start the day. Right, Gail? We love puppy snuggles. Hi, I'm Molly Burke and I'm gonna take you from my first five to my last five. I am not a morning person. I'm definitely a night owl, so I prefer to sleep in and that's kind of the fun of being my own boss. I get to set those rules, so I'll usually wake up between 9.30 and 10 a.m. It is around 10.20 a.m. and it's time to start the day. One of my favorite things to do every single day is make my bed. All right, I've dragged myself out of the bed, so now it's time to make the bed, something I take great pride in. I love picking out all the fun textures, placing everything perfectly to make it all aesthetically pleasing. I've got the base here, this chunky knit blanket, these faux fur pillows. So now I just have to place my final two pillows here and then my final blankets and this beauty will be done for the day. Now I'm going to take you through my first five. So this is uh, an empty mug currently. In the morning when I wake up, it is filled with hot water with fresh lemon and sometimes even fresh ginger. I've got my liquid in here, my nice morning wake up juice, if you will. And I like to drink this because I talk a lot and you can hear I kind of have a morning voice right now. I just feel like it's such a good, fresh way to start the day. It's soothing on my stomach instead of starting with like a coffee right on my stomach. That would be way too much for me. I really need to keep my voice strong and healthy. And this is one of the things that helps me do that. Plus I get to like pick out a cute, fun mug every morning. My favorite place to get cute mugs is Anthropology. These are both from there. We've got Shine On, a little positivity in the morning. Then we have this one, which looks exactly like my guide dog Gallop. The next thing I do is head to my bathroom, brush my teeth, all the normal stuff you think of in the morning. And then comes the face routine. I always use black face cloths so that makeup stains and stuff don't show. All of my products in my bathroom have very specific placement because I'm blind. I can't just like rummage through a messy drawer to find things. So I keep things super, super organized in my bathroom drawers. I have little separators and organizers. So this is mostly morning products. This is mostly evening products. So like my night routine, it would be, you know, my makeup remover, my cleanser, my serum, my eye cream, my face cream, my acne treatment all in a row. So it like all lines up exactly how I want to grab it. So this, is the first one I'm grabbing for. Sometimes I start my morning by just using a toner and then a moisturizer. And sometimes if I feel like I need a deeper cleanse, I'll use the Summer Fridays Super Amino Gel Cleanser. That is a mouthful. I am using my cleanser today and not just a toner because I'm having a little bit of a hormonal breakout prior to my menstrual cycle starting. So I just wanna do a bit of a deeper cleanse to help clear that up. And I'm just so obsessed that this has a pump top, my favorite thing. I'm a sucker for a cleanser with a pump top. It's such a nice lightweight consistency. It feels like such a nice wake up in the morning. Mm, fresh and clean. This is my holy grail morning moisturizer. And it's by Tarte Cosmetics. It's the drink of H2O. It is such a great consistency. Hopefully I don't spill it everywhere. I'm one of those people, because I'm not a morning person, my morning routine is as slimmed down and as quick as it can possibly be. Just get a little bit on my fingers. Just, oh. So I just like grab this sucker, toss it on my face. That's pretty much all I do for my skin in the morning, although today I might put a little bit of acne treatment on and then I'm gonna head to do my makeup because this is the perfect base under my makeup. I have a nice vanity set up with all my products. Again, perfectly organized, exactly where they need to be. Have a busy day today. I'm shooting some photos for my new merch launch um, and I have some video stuff to film. So I'm gonna sit down and do my makeup. No two days look the same, which means every day I play with my face and make it look something different too. I can do my full face in under 10 minutes or I can give myself 40 minutes. Just depends on the time I have that day and the look that I'm going for. Of course, nobody wants to be smelly all day, so I grab this sucker right here. This is the La Vanilla Healthy Deodorant. I've been using this deodorant for, I wanna say, 10 or 11 years now, a really, really, really long time. This has been a part of my routine. So before I get dressed, before I do my hair, I sit down and I do my makeup, and here at my vanity, I keep my deodorant. So nobody likes to be stanky this has to go on. I've tried a lot of different natural deodorants. I also like the Schmitz natural deodorant, 
but I would say this is my favorite. Although it's slightly less budget friendly and it has won Allure's Best in Beauty, so you know it's good. So I'm a big caffeine person. I need my caffeine. If I'm one of those days where I need like crazy levels of energy, I'll do coffee. But if I want to like stay calm and focused, it's matcha. And this is my go-to obsession. I love this drink so much. While I do my makeup, I just finished up my lemon ginger water. So now I'm moving on to hustle for some good caffeine. I only have one caffeinated beverage a day. So when I have this or my coffee in the morning, that's it for the rest of the day. All right, so those are my first five that get me ready for my day. I have no standard day. There is no like typical day in the life of Molly. You know, some days I'm filming for YouTube. Look, you guys know, it's not new. Like I love shopping. I love shopping, okay? We're taking Instagram photos or TikToks. I figure out what color I wanna go for and then honestly, I have a sighted person help me. So whether that be my mom who's sighted and lives with me or using an app like Be My Eyes where I can call and have a sighted person answer and use my phone to help me find the color. Busy day is done, so now it is time for my last five. I don't have a set bedtime. It completely depends. I try to be asleep before midnight, so my night routine, depending on the night, can be up to like two hours long if I'm really like going in on it. My dog Gallup, he's a sleeper like no other sleeper you've ever met. He's the king of sleeping. Naps are his side hustle, so he is always popping between his bed, my bed, and the cold tile of the bathroom. Being a kitten still, Lavender is very rambunctious. Lavender's favorite time to wake up is between 4.30 a.m. and 6 a.m., which is not my preferred time to wake up, so that's something we're working through. One of the things that I really like to do every night is use a foam roller. I mainly use it to roll out my back. It's about 8.30 in the evening. I have just finished shooting my new avocado merch collection um, and now I'm about to de-stress and start my foam rolling relaxation night routine. I've got a candle lighting, I've got all the mood lights going on. I'm gonna throw a podcast on my phone, lay it down beside me and get de-stressing. In 2020 we're all always hunched over computers, looking at our phones, so we're always hunched all day. So it's nice to just force your body to go the other direction. The next thing I always like to do is remove my full face of makeup. I have changed into a comfy unicorn onesie to continue the relaxation vibes. And just got a brand new one. I'm so excited to open this fresh baby up. Again, one of Laura's best in beauty, so you know it's good. And this is the Pharmacy Green Clean Cleansing Balm. I have a pretty extensive skincare routine at night. I really love to pamper myself and make my night routine just as long as possible and as over the top as possible so that by the time I'm crawling into bed, I'm feeling so fresh, so clean, so ready, so tired and relaxed. And it removes all of my makeup. I have very sensitive eyes, so a lot of makeup removers make my eyes really sting and burn, so I've had to be really careful. This stuff is so good. It smells amazing. It doesn't burn my eyes when I try to remove my eye makeup. Really gentle on your skin. Don't burn your eyes. Get everything off, face makeup, eye makeup, and it smells amazing. To me, having good skin is the base of good makeup. And like I said earlier today, I do have a bit of a hormonal breakout. So right now I'm gonna do a face mask, do some acne treatment, and then I'll see you in a minute. One thing that I always love to do at the end is use a face oil. A face oil is something I do switch in and out. This one, the one I'm currently using is the Tarte Maracuja oil. And then I'm gonna take this vibrating um, facial roller. It was like $20 on Amazon. And I use this not only to push the oil further into my skin, but what I really, really love this for is massaging the sides of my face because I have a very tight TMJ. I have to wear a night guard when I sleep. I've literally cracked teeth because I clench so hard at night when I sleep. I like to go down the sides of my neck. along the jaw. After I've done my full skincare routine, brushed, flossed, all the things, I head over to my beautifully made bed. You can see I have this big oaf lying on my bed. He's very satisfied and comfy. I unmake the bed and then in my bedside drawer, I have my melatonin, which I take pretty much every night to help me sleep. And then I do my final 
moisturizing. It's time to get that final hit of hydration before bed. I would say if there's one product in my entire routine that I cannot live without, it's this one singular product that I end my day with every single day, which is the Bite Beauty Agave Lip Mask. I always have one of these in my bedside table, in my travel makeup bag, everywhere I go. This is how I end the day. I cannot sleep without this specific product on my lips. And then we have my hand cream. So I use this product from Moroccan Oil. It is their hand lotion. That's a good feeling. That's a good smell. Moroccan Oil. Mm, does it right. Thanks for checking out my first five and my last five. It is time for this unicorn and for myself to get some sleep. So good night, Allure. Sleep well.